Hello everyone and welcome to the tenants given to me by Ancient Forge Studio. First of all, I am ecstatic to be able to play this game. However, that's a little lie. As you can see, I've already had um, a chance at playing the game because this is um, highlighted. Anyway, I have been keeping an eye on this game for since like forever. Ever since I first heard about a game, I have been keeping an eye on it. So, now the question is, do I continue from where I was or do I start new? But that's not a hard um, one to think on for too long. We will start brand new. Okay, so we will go with this young lady because she has glasses. I have glasses. And I also have straight black hair. I say straight, but my hair is terrible today. If you've come across a bug, an issue, or you simply want to tell us how you feel about a game, please use the in-game feedback tool. Pretty nifty. I've never actually used it. I'm actually part of the Discord. and <laughs> Let's just say I take over the channels when I talk. So, uh, AFS, uh, <laughs> I'm very sorry about that. I do apologise. I don't mean to take over. I'm just excited. I'm very excited about this game. But yeah, they have a Discord. I will put that in the uh, description below if you guys want to join as well and ask the developers some questions because they are really, really friendly folk. <clears throat> Welcome to Wondersville, where I was reading that. For now, most of the city will remain inaccessible, but we'll unlock other districts over time. Ready to dive in? Click on the slums district and meet me there. I'll explain more as we go. Ooh, that looks nice. I like that. There you are. Nicely done. I've seen folks get lost in this place before. Anyhow, check out your cell phone. I've left a job for you. Better take it before someone else does. I actually wonder what happens if you leave it for ages. Will it actually be taken or will it just stay? Nice. I oh, knew you'll do just fine. Okay, now on to the real thing. Let's take a look at my old camper. My friend Pedro used to live in it. And it might look messy. But I bet you'll make it all nice and fancy. I nearly said Pietro. That's why I paused for a moment there. I've been watching WandaVision a lot recently. Right, I'm in. Looks like this place is listed with garbage. Why don't we start with that? I know you don't like to get dirty, so just let me know what you want to clean up and I'll do the rest. Oh, poor guy. Poor uncle. What's his name? Uncle Sam? Yeah, ain't going to stop the two of us if we keep this up. Still plenty to go through, including a bunch of damage and broken furniture. Let me know what I should do with it. Oh, well, that, 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 oh. Not only did we not get furniture that time, we also lost money. The simple fact that we couldn't sell it to actually get any money to begin with. That's kind of sad. So there is actually a couple of ways of moving. So you've got WASD to move. If you hold down Q and move your mouse about, you can also rotate and zoom in if you use the mouse wheel at the same time. I, I kind of like the controls. That It's changed a lot because I used to actually play... um. They had a demo version, which I played, which was quite short. And then AFS brought out a free trial, which was a, which was a demo as well, but it was a lot longer. They've made a lot of changes since the demo times. Click on the apartment and enter the renovation mode. I want to see how it looks from up close. Well, you know, you've actually moved me further away from it. Welcome to the renovation model. In this mode, game time will run slower so that you can you can focus on the job at hand. As you can see in the top left corner, your remaining budget for the job is highlighted in blue to distinguish it from your own money. Yeah, how many times have I hit the budget on this? <laughs> Use the menu at the bottom of the screen to access different renovation options. Some of them are not available yet, but don't worry, you'll get to them eventually. You can go back to the game, try clicking on the leave button in the last tab. It already looks so much better. Now let's take care of the floors. Look at the checklist on the right and pick the appropriate type of floor. You can hover over the items icon to learn more about them. So here it says, finished floors, 0% hardwood. And down here you can see that any hardwood types are selected. So I'm the type of person who doesn't like to have everything the same. So let's have two. Excellent. Now we'll see if you can do the walls just as well. Don't forget to check the requirements on the right side of the screen. And we want grey. And like before, I did say that I am a bit fussy with walls. Um, so let's do that. Also, if you 
um, hold down shift and then click, it will um, completely do the room that you're doing. However, since I am doing uh, one room, two different colors, because I can't add walls yet, then I can't do shift because it will mess up what I'm doing. <clears throat> Perfect. Now on to the most interesting part, furnishing. Pick whichever piece of furniture you like and place it in the apartment. You can rotate an item with Z and C. You can also rotate the camera by holding Q. I just told them that. Anyway, oh, items on the right, you can see what we need. So, first of all, I want to move this out the way because I don't like it being a shower room. It just feels very unsafe. Electrical box near water? Eh, uh, no, whose smart idea was that to begin with? So we have the shower, and we need a toilet and toilet paper for the rest of the room. I would like to add a sink, but I don't think I have the money nor the space for that right now. Hopefully later I'll be able to sort that out. So we'll put that. Actually, no, I might be able to fit a sink in. Toilet paper. Ah, we'll have a, a dainty sink. There we go. Okay, Mama Cat has sorted it out. And just a little brush because people have accidents. Okay, so we need a couch, a TV, and a microwave. And potentially DVDs if we can afford it. So, but we'll move that fridge a little. Um, just to be, just to advise you guys, I'm not the best at decorating, but I do try. Please, please be gentle with me. <laughs> we'll put that there because who doesn't want to be warm in the mornings? Um, I guess I'm going to be sleeping on the floor. Yeah. Okay, so we want a couch. And we will choose, since the room's like this, I want to go with this. So hopefully it matches. And... Oh, our budget's quite... Yeah, we're doing well with the budget. We might actually be able to decorate afterwards. So we need a TV. But I think... Yeah, TV. And no harm, no foul. We want a microwave and the potential for DVDs. So what we'll do is go to decorations. We will not go to decorations. We will go back to the living room area because I clicked on the wrong thing. We'll get the DVDs and put them there. So that's sorted. DVDs. Uh, is there a DVD player? Because there's no point having DVD. Uh, there's no point having DVDs if you've got no DVD player. So we need a microwave. We'll go to kitchen area. Oh, I do like me some... Oh, you know, when I've got my own place sorted, I would love to do that. Okay. There we go. All done. Awesome. It looks pretty nice. Now head over to the finalize tab and click on the deliver tab. Hang on, uncle. Hang on, darling uncle. I just want to do... Um, hang on. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. We're going to pretend that's a shower rug, okay? And we will put in something nice. I, that's the... We do not want to put anything near the electricals without causing a fire. That would be a bad idea. Also, that is looking really bare. So, give me a minute. Give me a minute. Uh, sure, why not? This is what we can do. And deliver the job. All finalised. Ta-da! All done. Now that you've finished your first official job, I'll let you in on a secret. Your aunt and my dear wife left you this unit. Oh, does that mean she died? Oh, oh dear. I think it's a perfect opportunity to get your landlord career started, but the apartment will require some upfront work before we can rent it out. Uh, oh, we need... I, oh, my money. My money just went. Oh dear. Great, we've got electricity now. You'll have to take some more jobs and save up for installing the heating and for some renovation work. Good luck. Simple renovation jobs unlocked. Looks like you're ready to start working on other people's projects now. The jobs app on your phone now features simple renovation jobs for you to pick up. Brilliant. Oh. Guess. Oh, okay. This tells us about the job. Guess the job done. It's worth every penny to see your flat uh, rearranged in such a masterful way. Four star. Got 4,000, which went to the electricity bill, which is a bit annoying. Ah, okay, so we have a couple of jobs. Um, I I write stories with a friend of mine, and their surname is Niall, or Neil, however you pronounce it. So we'll do that. Because coincidence, I think not. Okay, so we need to do... What do we need to do? I wasn't paying attention. Bedroom, yes, of course. 
When performing renovation jobs, you have to focus on different rating categories to score five stars. Decor category might be the trickiest to get right. The reviewer will rate decor based on the amount of money you spend on decor items. Every type of room has a separate list of items that affects the score. To achieve a high decor rating, check out the room info window and see what types of items are taken into consideration in a given room type. Okay, so it's this room I'm guessing. Well, <laughs> obviously. That's a nice living area by the way, I really like that. Yeah, nice. Okay, so they uh, finished walls. Um, game, I think you may be bugged. Okay, so let's go with red. Okay, so that is correct now. And we want carpet or linen. We'll go with carpet and something matching. There we go. I don't like this bedroom already, but then again, I, I don't, I'm not fond of red bedrooms for some reason. Okay, so bedroom. They want a single bed. Uh, we'll give them this. Hopefully it won't blow our budget too much. I am a bit concerned. Actually, let's go down one. There we go. We'll put that here. And we can change it if we do have the money. You want a workout bench. Why do you want a workout bench in a bedroom? 2000 for a workout Duh. Are you kidding me? I'm not going to be able to afford everything now. Oh. 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 This might have been a bad idea to do. Okay, let's keep trying. Anyway, lamp. Let's go for a cheap lamp because you guys did not give me much of a budget. You're on a small plant and two motivational posts. Okay, maybe we can do this. Guys, work with me here, please. Yeah, you can have that there. All right, and two motivational posters. So, the motivational, motivational patients. Wow, I can't talk today. Work hard, play hard. And did you smile today? We'll throw in another one for free. No, we'll throw that one there. Okay, so I do have some money. So, clock is wanted. We'll move that there. Hopefully, that doesn't tickle their feet as they sleep. So, we need... let's see. Because there's no point putting the little clock on the floor, is there? There really isn't. So here's our clock. We'll put that there. Uh, maybe we can do a rug or something, you know, something to warm their feet up. Uh, yeah. We have 853 left. Let's see. Decor is actually the hardest part of this game. Um, you know what? Since they asked for a small plant, maybe we can get a big plant here. Yeah? Okay. Um, one of my friends, um, Tox, he's appeared in some of my videos already. He's actually quite good at decorating. He's, um, sad to say, actually quite, <laughs> actually better than me when it comes to decorating these things. Maybe I should have called him in and asked him to join my recording session, but, you know, you know it's a review day as well. He's not allowed in reviews. Okay. So there's that. Um, one more plant because uh, because it will let me. So yeah, this is basic. We don't have much money. We do still have 520, but I'll let that slide and see how we go from here. Deliver the job. I can't imagine you lif uh, lifting weights, lady. But you like the workout bench? That's good. That's very good. Do you like the poster? Good, good. You like the poster. Oh, what about the other one? Did you smile today? You did smile today with hearts in your eyes. That's brilliant. So glad to hear it. What do you think of the room overall, though? You're happy with it. Okay. What? But, but you loved everything in it. Why are you not loving it? What is this abuse? Okay, level up. Nice. Four star. It's worth every penny to see your flat rearranged in such a masterful way. Gets the job done. You, you, you pretty much said the same thing as Uncle Steve. But you just changed the... Never mind. Alright, let's see what else we've got. We have... Let's see. We'll go with... Callum. Because I actually have a friend... Well, I actually have an acquaintance from uni. His name is Callum. And I was um, checking on him earlier today. Let's see. 
So you want a bedroom. So here we can actually choose which room to go with. So due to space, I will go with a bigger room. Why, why is that tape? Okay, no, ignore that guys. Just because it's crossed out doesn't mean it's actually done. So we need hardwood. Hardwood or linum? Linum. We'll go with linum this time. I'm not even sure pronouncing that right. And we want red or grey wool. So we will go for grey wool. You know what? That's not bad. That reminds me of one of my old rooms. Okay. So we need a single bed. And that bed looks comfy. <laughs> is anyone else feeling sleepy? Or is it just me? So. Uh, what? I just realised. This one wants a workout bench too. Why does everyone want a workout bench? Is it because of the lockdown? It's because we've been in lockdown. Everyone's working out now. Good on you lot. <laughs> Bad on me because I'm not very keen on working out. Alright, so we need a lamp as well. Um, yeah. Imagine waking up and that bonks you on the head. That would actually be kind of funny. Then again, I am a bit cruel sometimes. I just like seeing people get hurt. In a funny way. Not in a way that actually gets people hurt. Don't ever think that I want people to get hurt because I don't. I really don't. Right, so, small plant and two motivational posters. Again, we'll get a shelf in this time. Bear in mind, guys, uh, just because I've had the same job twice does not mean that you will get the same job twice. It does vary from time to time. And you do get some very nice um, job opportunities come up as well. So, motivational posters. You know the drill, guys. Okay, so I've seen something I can throw in that might give me some bonus points, and that is the treadmill. Hopefully that gives me some bonus. If it doesn't, then I try it at least. Okay, so that is everything ticked off. Now we need a clock and a desk lamp. So let me think about this for a moment. Okay, so that's that. And a desk lamp. Huh, where are we going to put it? You know, I might as well put an actual desk in and then put it that way. Uh, yeah, that, that totally works. We're fine. What are we worried about? Actually, no. No, instead of a desk, um, we will do... We will do this. We will get that little one in. Nope, that doesn't match the rest of the decor, does it? There we go. We'll get that in. And it was a desk lamp they wanted. So that will be... That will not be in the place I thought it was going. There we go. Then because the room is a grey colour, we will go with a greyish colour to match. Now, do we have anything we can put on the floor? So, because it might just be an o OCD thing of mine, but I hate having plain floors. Don't you guys? Yeah? Good. I'm glad you're agreeing with me. Now, let's put in some more posters. If it will let me select it. That, no, we've already had that one. <laughs> be brave you're working out be brave and there okay so basic room is basic let's see if they like this one shall we decor was wow that was a very low rating i said if i had more unlocked things and more money i would actually be um i would actually um decorate a bit better what did I see a sad face just then? Excuse you? Uh, hey, you don't like my decorating style? Wow. Rude much? You like the treadmill? Okay, so there's something. New items unlocked. We're doing a good job there. What did she say? Oh, okay. So you literally just copied and pasted what someone else said. Okay. So, we need to earn $700. Alright, fair enough. And all these have at least $700. Ooh, okay, let's try this slightly harder one by Theodore. Nice name, by the way, Theodore. Reminds me of a little mouse for some reason. And you need a new bathroom put in. Okay, fair is fair. So, that's a nice little heater. I've never seen that one before. Okay, so... You know how it goes, guys. Pick a wall, any wall. One that matches the scheme. Boom. Done. Tile, laminate, up, 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 and we're going. Imagine it's Tom and Jerry for some reason. Okay, so. Bathtub or shower cabin? We will go with a bathtub because it's been a while since I've used one of these. 
no, we will go with this one. Because, no, we will stop changing our mind, apparently. There we go. Before I change my mind again. Okay, so, bathroom sink, toilet, toilet brush. Okay. Never used the corner one before. That must be a new one. Alright, let's throw a mirror in, because why not? I can't stand when people make the bathroom without the mirror for some reason. It gets on my nerves. So we need a toilet. We'll put it close to the door because late night drinking shenanigans, you want to use the loo, you don't want to end up not using the loo. And put some extra bog roll because you're going to need it. Let's face it, you're going to need it. I'm pretty sure they'll need that for any clothes that they have. And since we've done everything, we can do the bonus, which is a wall clock. And I've got two types of wall clock, but for the sake and purpose of everything, we'll go with the cheaper one so that I have more money to splash out on. Oh, yes, yes. Give me some red. Give me some red to match some decor I put in. Okay, now, what would be nice is a nice long painting of sorts. No, we do not want the world map. What's the world map going to do for us? Or we can be... Yes. We will put some movie posters in because best place to think of movies is the toilet, let's face it. And we will finish off with... Yes, yeah, see? That's not too bad now, is it? Now, for some reason, every time I've done a bathroom job, they like hanging, hanging, uh, hanging plants. So we'll put that in and hopefully <laughs> this person also likes hanging plants. Oh, decor 100% done. So... Let's see how it just goes. We should hopefully get higher marks this time. Yes, love the toilet paper. Just don't start stocking all of it. Yeah, you love the plant? Brilliant, brilliant. What about the toilet? It's the most expensive toilet I got. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. Overall, what do you think of the room? <gasps> you love it, brilliant. Please say that gets me top marks. I will be mortified if I don't get top marks. Night kitchen stuff, okay. Let's see. Five star, folks. That's how it's done. Five star. I thought only my brother-in-law could do such miracles with a putty knife and a paint roller. A job well done. I feel guilty for paying so little. Excellent work needs to be rewarded. And you did. You, re you rewarded me with a level up. And, by the looks of things, we can get the heating installed at my aunt's place. So let's get that done. Did you just yawn into the wall, or was that just me looking strange on her? Hey, Here we go. Okay, first we need to clean this place up. Send me in and let's get started right away. You know the drill and I've got a surprise for you. You do? Should I be concerned? I didn't mean to press off that, never mind. Yep, that's right. I've managed to track down a nice little storage area for your scavenging hunts. You know how plenty of folks are. I was reading that. Plus, some of the stuff you can find there is quite special. Be on the lookout for the so-called unique items and make sure you don't waste them on some fool's run-down studio apartment. Anyway, let's wrap this up. In other words, you mean let's clean this up, not wrap it up. Why would you want to wrap up the trash? Or maybe it's um, an American way of saying things. You want to wrap things up when you clean? I don't know. I'm not American. I'm British. Okay, so it looks like they've added some extra animations as well, because um, last time I did this, when you mopped up a, um, a puddle, it just went poof, rather than you can actually see it getting worked on. Nice, we now have a football game. Okay, so, let's leave that. Yes, we want to leave that. Awesome, now we can finally get to work and finish up Auntie's old place. Why do you keep calling her Auntie? She's your ex-wife? Dead wife? Question mark? Ready to rock and roll. You can now access remodeling tools to build and demolish walls. Use them responsibly. Uh, I can try. As you can see, you've unlocked a new innovation tool called remodeling. Let's try it out now. Bulldoze one of the inner walls first. That felt nice, but let's see if you can build walls just as well, just as you can tear them down. Not bad. Now onto the doors. You can be placed in an existing inner wall. Try if you can to do it. Well, let me just 
finish my design first. Hang on. Hang on, Uncle. You mean like it? It looks like you've learned the basics by now. It's time to meet all the requirements on the list. Remember, the better the interior design, the wealthier tenants will want to live in your units. I'll leave you to do your thing. After all, you're the boss. I am the boss. I am indeed. So, as you can see, I've messed up the walls a little. Well, I say messed, but I mean uh, moved the walls about a bit. So, we need a common, a common room, a bedroom, and a bathroom. So, since we will... Um, since those are the three rooms we want, we will start with the smallest room, which is the bathroom. As you can see, I've chosen uh, to make it a small one. Because you don't need too much in a bathroom, let's face it. What, what are you going to need in there? A freaking suit of armour? I don't think so. You're not going to need a suit of armour. So, let's focus on getting everything we need in here first. And then we can do some paintwork. You know what? For the size of the thing we've got, that's not too bad a size. I'm actually quite happy with that. We're not going to fit anything else in there. <laughs> Apart from maybe some cleaning materials. Anyway, like I said earlier, if you hold down shift, you will be able to instantly paint a room. Like so. Makes it so much easier and so much quicker. Voila, done. Bathroom done. Um, we will need to move some items as well because I don't think the bath the bedroom's a good idea to have it right away. Unless, you know, you're one of those people who kind of wants it, in, you know, straight away. But yeah, let's um, move the fuse box here. Oh, you know, I just realised I may have messed up a little, but we're fine. Uh, we can sell that. We're not, we don't need that. It's nice to have, but... We don't need it, and it gave us extra money instead. So, the heater in the fuse box, you don't need to have in the common room. That's a misconception in this game. You don't need to have them in the same room. What you do need, however, is a fridge. Now, because we don't have much money, and we're actually using our own budget this time, what I'm going to do is I'm going to get a mini fridge, and I will stick a microwave on top of that. Problem solved. Um, it does leave a bit of a space here, so let me just move that so it's not too bad looking. Yeah, we can put a plant or something here. So, we will put... There. It's not my favourite plant, by the way. It's just something I keep picking up for some reason. Okay, we'll go back to that in a minute, because we're not done there. We'll go back to that. Now, the bedroom. I've, I've wanted to use the most expensive, but I won't, because the money situation in this game. We do not have much money yet. So we have a bed. And we will decorate the room in a blue hue because my favourite colour is blue, surprisingly. If you haven't noticed already, my favourite colour is blue. Now, the only room that looks the best is the bathroom and that's kind of depressing. So let's spice this up a little. Bearing in mind, we don't. We also do not want to spend all the money we have at the moment because we all end up in trouble. But we do, at the same time, as um, Uncle Steve said, we want this to look nice, so we'll get some potential buyers in. Um, that rug is temporary. I will switch that out later. So let's see what else we have. We have an easel, which could be nice. You never know. People might like to do a bit of uh, painting. I mean, with me... I I, not, I'm not the best at painting, per se, but it is relaxing to have. Also, please don't bonk your head on that. Uh, <laughs> funny story, actually. Um, when I was younger, I used to have a bunk bed, and I always used to bash my head on the top, on the ceiling, because I slept on the top uh, roof, and I always bonked, bonked my head there. Anyway, so, let's see. Can we afford a desk? Because a desk could be nice. A desk... Uh, we can afford a computer, but it's going to hit us quite hard there. Okay, so that's not bad. That's not too bad now. We can add... Um, yeah, we'll pretend that the person moving in is a study freak. Okay, now the one thing I want to add here is a TV. Because otherwise you're just going to sit there bored with nothing to do. So, 
Why is that so small? Oh, that's a shelf. I got so confused from that. You probably heard it on my voice. I was confused. So we'll give you an expensive TV. Which takes our budget down. But we still have enough money to do a little bit more renovation. So, we've done the walls. And hopefully the floor. So, that is as far as I'm willing to go, question mark. Can I afford a painting for the living room at all? You know what? We'll do that to remind myself that I overspent. Okay. So that is the kitchen, the bathroom, the bedroom. As you can see here, it says common, but as long as we've got all the items ticked off, it'll be fine. We'll be fine. Looks like you got the unit ready for renting. Let's go to the open house panel and start it right away. On an open house day, people interested in your rental will come by to check the apartment out. Okay, so let's have a look. Begin open house. We'll use leaflets and it's a whole apartment I'll be renting out. It looks like we've got our first potential tenant. How exciting! Let's click on her and try to make a good deal. Keep in mind that the better first impression your property makes, the more your tenants will be willing to pay for it. Oh, it's making a good impression then. Good, she's smiling. So let's negotiate with her. And her name, oh, she's a gamer. She's a fast food worker. She is 26 years old and she gets a salary of 80,000. And her name is Cindy Weeks. Not bad. Okay, let's see, make her an offer. Okay, so we are requesting 2,770, but she will go no higher than 2,305. Given that at the moment we can't really argue because we don't have money, we will accept her offer. Good job, we've got our first tenant. I hope she'll like the place you've designed. I hope she'll like the place I've designed as well, to be honest. She's probably calling her parents saying, oh no, I've moved into a dump. <laughs> Elite contracts are unique jobs that will take you around the more gradenoirs properties of Wondersville. Did I say that right? They feature an array of unique items that you won't be able to find anywhere else unless you play it dirty and decide to snatch a few of them for yourself by adding them to your player storage. You have a limited amount of time to accept these offers, so you have to act quick if you're down for something extra spicy. I think we do have one available. Do we? Yes, we do. Okay, so we're by the lake. You sure this is the lake? It doesn't feel like a lake. Okay, so we got a storage room that we're not allowed to mess with because that would be classified as stealing. We can only work on the rooms that we have been specified because you could lose money and stuff and we don't really want to lose money now, do we? Oh, dang. I was really hoping you was able to repair that. Okay, is that gold? Oh, it's a treasure chest. Ah, oh, nice. Nice. We actually get we actually got some money for um cleaning that up. So that's an, a nice, nice bonus. Clean the money. Get money. This is this a pun on dirty money by any chance? That is developers, you did that on purpose, didn't you? Okay, and now that Uncle Steve is done, we can get him to go, and then we can get to work. I can get to work. You know what I mean. Okay, so, Captain's Cabin. Da -da -da -da. We need a sailor's hammock. We have a sailor's hammock right here. So we don't need to actually remove that. This is also something we can... Yeah. Boat decoration. So... By fixing the items, we actually saved ourselves some money. So, Captain's Cabin. I feel like I'm making like a reception desk for a moment there. Okay, so we are doing this quickly. Oh. Sometimes I get like a different gramophone, like a very small one for some reason. Wine rack. Okay, so that isn't in there. That will be in the kitchen thing for some reason. Yes, uh, wine rack by the by the sleeping area, please, please. You know that when you need to go to sleep, you you, you want um, you, you know you want a nice bit of a tipple before you go to sleep. Yes, that's that's how it works in for sailors, right? Because sailors are famous for drinking. 
Because you know that song? What can you do with a drunken sailor? Easy, just give him extra booze. Okay, so, treasure map. Because I'm sure the captain is going to go sailing one of these days. Boat decorations. Uh, we have not done the walls and floor. I am so for that. I completely spaced out. That doesn't look like a sailor's one does. Okay, for we're going to switch that. There we go. It costs extra money to switch if you've made a mistake, but, you know, that was my bad. That, I really don't like brown color schemes. Okay, so we need three more boat decorations. So, I can go there. Just don't bonk yourself on the head. Don't let it fall on your head, rather. Hey, you, believe it or not, but I've got a bunch of roaches roaming around the apartment. What the heck? Could really use some assistance, boss. These ones look quite nasty. Darn, it looks quite, it looks pretty serious. In situations like this, you'll often have a few ways of dealing with the problem. I'd advise you solving the issue with my help to strengthen your relationship with the tenant. Oh, that's disgusting. Great, I'm in the apartment waiting your orders. I reckon we should get rid of all those nasty bugs with a healthy dose of the anti-bug spray. Good. Perfect, now let's get rid of the rest of them. Oh, what did what did Cindy do to cause this? I'm sure that gas is not a good thing to live in either. Thanks for helping me solve this problem. Now that's something I call a job well done. Let's exit the apartment. The tenant should be thankful for our swift reaction. <sighs> Babysitting jobs are not new job types available in the jobs app. Brilliant. But let's go back to the job we were working on before we got interrupted. Okay, so we still need boat decorations and a wall decor. 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 How do you guys pronounce it? Decor? Decor? Eh, extra candle never hurt nobody. That's a barrel. I was hoping... There we go. Now I need wall decor. Decorum es popotria more. Yes, because who doesn't want to be able to see <laughs> Who doesn't want to be able to see their map in the dark? Okay, that that works. All right, now because this is one of those big jobs, let's add a couple more things around. Doesn't matter if you duplicate the items; they don't seem to care much. Um, apart from when it doesn't actually want to go on the wall for some reason. Hang on, there we go. Barrel? I don't. Oh wait, I have one barrel. Let's add a few more barrels because our captain here is a drunk. What can you do with a drunken sailor? What can you do with a drunken sailor? What can you do with a drunken sailor early in the morning? And done. 92% done, but, you know, that's not too bad, considering we've had to duplicate some items. You don't like the captain's bill? What is wrong with you? Do you like the wine rack? Ah, see. Alcohol, the easiest way to make him happy. Do you like the LED light for your map reading at late at night? No, okay. <laughs> Fair enough, I didn't think it matched anyway. Why did I add it if I didn't think it matched? Anyway. You're happy with that? Brilliant. What about the hammock that I repaired for you? Was that a yes or a no just then? Four star. It's worth every penny to see your flat rearranged in such a masterful way. Catastrophe wasn't exceptional. Excuse you? I have nothing to complain about. Well. Fair enough. We got paid a bonus today. Which is... It's nice. We have a happy tenant, and you know, not they're not too bad. Is that that is a lake? That is not a lake. That is someone lied to me about the address. But anyway, this is all I have time for, sadly, and I'm so so sorry that I'm having to cut it short a bit because unfortunately my throat is giving up on me today. Because I've got a bit of a sore throat and I have been drinking in the background. But trying to do so whilst not annoying you guys. But anyway, thank you so, so much Ancient Forge Studio. I am so happy to be playing this game finally after following it for so long. Playing the demos and just waiting for the full version to come out. Um, I may very well do another video when I've got the chance to explain the other jobs. Because we've only covered renovations unfortunately. And we've covered the elite contracts as well. Um, hopefully Cindy Darling, who lives over here, won't be having roaches in her house any longer. But anyway, 
if you lovely people want to see more videos like this link to my coffee is in the description below as said previously i have also included a link to the discord for the tenants in case you want to add your own suggestions or you want to provide feedback or you want to speak to the developers yourself who are extremely friendly and they're really helpful anyway thank you so so much for watching and i'll see you all in the next video bye bye for now